of getting moving us forward. So let's look at what's cool about this. This is an event, right? So here are the details, comments, tickets. So you're going to see some really interesting. So the the layout is just different. I mean, this looks visually different. You have, you know, just some really nice colors. I mean, aesthetically, it looks great. But what's most interesting, especially on mobile, is the way these tabs operate. So you're just, you're just bringing up, so tickets, all right? There's not a, a, a ticket product attached to this event, comments. But if there, were, if there was, it would show up here. So let's look, let's do events and tickets. Let's just look at, Okay, so here, this one here does. So low roar live. Here's the event. It starts in X, Y, Z amount of days. Here it is on the map. You can get directions. Here's the category. Again, these look really, really sharp on mobile. I mean, this looks good on this screen as well, but where this theme really stands out is two things to me. One, on mobile, it looks awesome. Two, the level of granularity in that you can modify the templates, the listing displays, the, I mean, you can do so much cool stuff in terms of modifying the way everything is displayed and how everything appears. So if you look at the tickets, you'll see one. So we're going to click on that. It brings up a, a new screen and you can buy a ticket to this event, which brings up a WooCommerce product page. Now we've added it, we can go to the cart and you can buy a ticket to this event. So this means that you can sell premium functionality to your audience. So both the public audience as well as your professional peers. So you can sell a flat listing to Joe's Pizza and Joe's Pizza can just have a listing with no special accoutrements on his page or you can also give joe the ability to include a product on his listing an event on his listing and again this really in a functionally important way amps up the value that you are able to out of the box offer to your audience most of the themes and, you know, most of the frameworks, most of the, it's typically heavy lifting. So this, the folks behind this really thought this out very clearly and with a lot of foresight as to what people like us were going to be needing and people in the public were going to be wanting and people in the peer space or the professionals that are going to be on any sort of directory are going to ask for it. And I think that's really uh, important. And, you know, the other thing I'll say, not knowing these guys at all, having a little bit of conversation with them yesterday, just on the comment thread, um, they just seem like, I mean, these guys know what they're doing and, and they seem very accommodating. And I think that's a good thing for all of us. All right, so I mean, some of these theme makers and framework developers and otherwise, I mean, I've just seen one after the other that's just like not present when it comes to supporting um, their products. I, I don't know this for certain, but my sense is that that's gonna be the opposite case here. All right, so here is Lehman Restaurant, Lyman Restaurant, whatever. All right, so we're looking, and now look at the amount of stuff, actions that you can take in the header of this listing. All right, so you can add a review. You can bookmark it. I'm not signed in. Maybe I am. I don't know. Um, you can report it. Uh, I'm sorry. You can share it. You can report it, which I don't know why anyone has report listing. I, it just seems like a waste of space to me. Reviews, all right, so you can leave a review here. You can read the reviews here. Again, it is just the real estate on the space is really well accounted for in a highly functional and beautiful way. Events, it's really loading slowly. I think that's not the theme. I think it's my computer store booking. 
Okay, so you can book using TimeKit, which is also very cool. So I am making an appointment for October 18th at 11 a.m. And I would fill out my stuff here and I'd be able to book this. All right, I mean, again, it's all integrated in a very beautiful and highly functional way. Here's the shop, which again is WooCommerce. They have icons, which look great. I mean, you can just buy, you can, you can sell something like a t-shirt in the most basic form or sell whatever you're gonna sell on your store, or you can offer your clients the ability to sell stuff using an external product type, which in this case would be, let's say, an affiliate link. So this could be Joe's Pizza. This could be an affiliate link to Joe's Pizza's T-shirt. This could be Joe's Pizza's T-shirt. And you're just linking to Joe's store to buy, you know, for folks who want to buy a shirt. And this could be an affiliate link where you're making 20% or 30% or 40% of each T-shirt sale. And you can do this over and over and over again for each listing that you have. Again, this would instead of be add to cart, see in, in this case, this is all coming through your store. The benefit of using the external product type and having many of your listings submit products is you can make commissions on all of those products.